the special and magical powers of difference. So yeah, this is my universal belief that um, we we use the word disability or different or special as if it's something quite negative. Um, actually, it fits really nicely with this theme of we're going to come out differently, doesn't it? Um, but I do not believe in disability. I believe that that everybody has differences. Everybody has differences. And that disability is only what we as a society, we as a community, we as a physical environment make it. Um, it's the driving force of occupational therapy. We, we were saying this a long time before the World Health Organization started to talk about difference and dysfunction over disability. And I think the magical powers of difference are allowing ourselves to say this is different and wonderful. Um, so when I talk to young people with autism who have sensory processing difficulties we talk about them being their spidey senses or we talk about waiting for the muggles to catch up with their magical powers <laughs> or why they might have felt for quite a long time they had to hide their magical powers from other people because they didn't the muggles don't understand them and I think the magic power of difference for me is that we absolutely in our society depend on us having differences. We need to be different. Uh, I do this a lot with sibling work. You know, you are meant to have one child who's a bit louder and a bit more dewy and a bit less emotional and the other child who's a bit more emotional and a bit more nurturing and a bit more caring because in a family home, that means that they find their identity, doesn't it? So the magical power of difference is about acknowledging that we are not the same. We shouldn't drive to be the same. We shouldn't drive to cookie cutter ourselves or compare ourselves to others. We should drive ourselves to celebrate our differences and our abnormalities and our disadvantages are very often our double-edged sword of our magical powers. And I think looking at the power of difference during COVID is everything is different. So what magical power are you going to find in you that you didn't know you had? And what magical power are you going to find in your family that you may not have realised was there?